Niall just off the pitch. Preparation seemed to be going quite well. Yeah, yeah, we uh, took a bit of time there just to make sure we had everything ticked off and uh, we feel good coming off the pitch now that we're ready for what Doncaster are going to bring. It's just good to bring everyone up to speed and we're all on the same wavelength now, hopefully, uh, to go on our travels to Doncaster tomorrow. We obviously lost to Worcester twice, but we did well to get out of our group. It was a very tough group. We knew that the minute we saw it. So uh, I think with a young squad, we just have to take a lot of confidence that we got out of the group and it's just great to be involved in knockout rugby now. So obviously it's a huge opportunity, but yeah, we'll take our learnings from Worcester. There was a lot of them in two tight games, so uh, and obviously we'll just try and build more on what we did against Nottingham and Mosley. Looking ahead to the quarterfinal this weekend, so Doncaster, pretty pretty serious outfit. I mean, 100% record so far, 29 out of a possible 30 points. Yeah, you, you can't argue with 100% record. They're a very good team. We've watched them. They're a very big physical team, and that's what we'll see their biggest threat as, just their physicality is so, and their line speed. So we'll be obviously doing what we can to negate that, but yeah, they're a serious outfit, so we'll certainly be going over there respecting them a lot. Against Mosley, Nottingham and Worcester, we, uh, we learned how strong the championship sides can be, so uh, we won't be going over to Doncaster thinking any less. It's going to be a big physical battle, and we're just hoping that we're prepared for it. As one of the senior players on the side, you find yourself taking uh, more of a leadership role in the team? Yeah, it's funny, in the last kind of year I nearly feel old around here, which is probably very good for Munster, but uh, not so good for my own confidence. But uh, yeah, there's some great young players coming through and it's great to see them get a chance in a quarter-final now and we can kind of really get in and see what they're made of and knock out rugby and I have no fear any of them. I think that they'll be all well able for Doncaster on Saturday.